Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna show you how to enable unknown soul sources on any streaming device, whether you're using the NVIDIA seal, whether you're using a Fire TV stick, whether you're using a Fire TV cube or any semen device, I will show you how to enable the unknown sources. Okay guys, so with all that being said, let's get started. Subscribe to Streaming Wizards channel. Ding the notification bell. Press like on all of his videos. Share the video. And follow him on all his social media. Okay, guys. So, first of all, I'm gonna show you how to enable unknown sources on a Fire TV device that's the no. Fire OS 7, which is a Fire TV Stick 4K first generation, and on the other earlier devices, but for the Fire OS 7 above, I will be showing you how to enable unknown sources for them devices as well okay so on your fire os 5 and 6 devices you're just gonna go to the gear icon and maybe in the setting stuff on fire os 5 and then you want to navigate to my fire tv and then developer options and then you have to enable these two options ADB debugging and apps for Munnum sources you'll get a warning but it is perfectly safe so suspect turn on and that's it you've enabled your fire OS 5 and 6 devices unknown sources now let's head to the fire os 7 device which is the fire tv q the fire stick knight the fire tv stick third generation and also the 4k fire stick max okay guys so i'm at my tv and I'm gonna show you how to net enable unknown sources for the Fire OS 7 devices. The Fire TV Cube, the Fire Stick Knight, the Fire TV Stick 3rd generation, and the 4K Fire Stick Max. Okay, so all you wanna do is get your remote and then you want to go to settings once you're there you go down to my fire tv it's just right there and it's pretty much the same um process as on the fire or a six devices but if you go into developer options You'll see ADB debugging, which you want to turn on. But if you remember a second ago when we were on the 4K Fire Stick, it said apps for modern sources. And um, you just click once to turn them on. 
On these devices, however, you go to install unknown apps and then you turn on eight interfacial app on folks. So the app you most nine you will be using will be downloader. So I'm gonna turn on the downloader for install unknown apps and this is good because you're doing the individual ones as opposed to turning them all on with just one button on the Fire TV stick 4K first send raisin. So an app can install a virus on your fire stick. So if you have one of them third party streaming applications, it could download an app on your fire stick amp note where without your permission so that's why I prefer turning the interfacial apps on rather than turning them all on at the same time with one switch on the fire TV stick 4k now let's move on to the Bad Boy NVIDIA Seal or any other Android TV operating system device. Okay guys, so I'm on my NVIDIA Seal as you can see here guys. So all you want to do on the Android TV device is from this top bar here, you scroll up to it and then you go to the gear icon just there. Click on that and then you want to go to device references. And then you want to go to security and restrictions and then you want to go to unknown sources and Nikon the fire TV you because this London and one nine the sealed to has the insufficient apps so the most nine gonna use download it on the sealed as well so turn that one on and that can install unknown apps on your device now let's head over to the stock and white TV box so I'm on my Bing and C Tekken but the same nice to and the Android box that runs the official Android mobile OS. It could be a one switch or like an individual um, toggle because you may have an Android 7 box a an with a box or the Bainan CT can this is a an one line box but all you essentially do is go to your settings of your box and then go to device references again it could be unknown sources and then maybe security and restrictions right on your settings page but it might be device 
Intus and Golden Robert says security and restrictions and then unknown sources and it might ask you do you want to turn it on or you might come up nine and in turn each of the month sus nine that but It might not be in device buff and just security and restrictions. Might be on this home page just here. But all you're looking for is security and restrictions. And then unknown sources. If it does a toggle crate, it will turn itself on. Otherwise, click on it. Turn one eight on volts. Now let's move on to our Chromecast with Google TV users. Okay, so for the Chromecast with Google TV, all you want to do is go to your Google icon just right over there. Once you found it. You've seen this when you appear and then you want to click on the option settings and then you want to scroll down to system and then you want to go to about scroll all the way down the build and then tap it about 10 times 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so seven times to be exact and it will say you're at the developer okay so let's go back and then you want to find y for c and now in this security and this reasons and then you're gonna send that unknown sources and you're gonna turn that on both so if you don't enable developer options like if you turn developer options off like if you turn it off then you go back to privacy security and then you can't access it why i don't know but you're gonna have to enable those developer options once again system about tap that seven times go back go to privacy Go to security and restrictions, and then you'll be able to access it there. So there we go. Now is how to enable unknown sources on the most common streaming devices, folks. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please make sure to. To subscribe to Streaming Wizard's channel, ding the notification bell, press like on all of his videos, share the video, and follow him on all his social media. Okay, guys, until next time, bye.